Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. I want to turn off the... So close, yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. Unless you want to hang out with him after you stood up for his ass yesterday. Oh, please. I can't abuse this level of my rewind power. It's way too dangerous, and I need to navigate the present. Oh. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Anything I can do for you, Max? I... I was just waiting for Chloe to get out of the bathroom so we can go. I owe you one. So I'll pretend what you just said is true, Missy. Excuse me. That's Miss Caulfield. Yes, sir. You and Chloe still better be careful where you wander. There are a lot of dark places in Arcadia Bay. What do you mean by dark places? I can't tell you everything that's going on at Blackwell. And you've seen too much already, so please stay out of this, Max. Too late. I already know way too much. So, do you and Nathan Prescott... That little shit-ass Nathan Prescott is lucky he only got suspended. I don't think luck had anything to Yay! do with it. Yay! He hates Nathan. I could have been suspended too. I didn't have all the evidence at the time. I... I am sorry, Max. Anyway, I think we can both agree it's been a hard week on all of us. Especially poor Kate Marsh. To help Kate. I tried to help Kate. You did, Max. You saved her life like a hero while I left the goddamn dorm roof wide open. I knew Kate was feeling desperate. You even made it to the roof before me or anybody. I knew Kate was desperate, too. So did Mr. Jefferson. That guy is an elitist prick, and I'm off duty, so I can say it at home behind his back. Like when Chloe calls me step douche. These artists live in a fantasy world. Why do you say that? Why do you say that? These art farts are all about themselves. When I was in the service, I hated the photographers who tried to pose me in their anti-war bullshit. Well, Blackwell Academy is a school for artists, so maybe this isn't the best place for you. I have a family here, Max, and I think Blackwell is the best place for me, since only I know what's happening. That's why I'm working out the new Blackwell surveillance plan to protect future students so they don't end up like Rachel Amber and Kate Marsh. Although, you're like a walking surveillance system. I appreciate you standing up for me. But I have to be a hard ass and tell you and Chloe to stay the hell out of this. Things are just gonna get more ugly. Chloe and I can take care of ourselves. Now excuse me, Max. I have to get back to my camera. See, I'm an artist too. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. 
Hey, David, what you hiding? It was seven. It was seven. One. One, right? Yeah! Yes. I knew that number would be important. Yeah! I'm so. I'm so good. Good! I'm good! Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Oh my god. Can, like, if any of my followers or, like, just people who are watching know longitude and latitude, could y'all, like, plug that into, like, Google Maps or something and just put this. Like in Google Maps, so I can figure out where these are. Thanks, love you guys. Oh my God, no! Oh, he takes good pictures too. Score. Back to Chloe now. I give up William, but defend David. Would Chloe hate me if she knew? Yo, Chloe. Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. It's Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus there's some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Yay. I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. What if he's fixing this that up? This is definitely Kate's floor. The hospitals always freak me out. I, I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little, a little nervous. nervous. Just go in there and be her friend. I'll wait out here so you can chill by yourselves. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Stop making Thanks, this. Chloe. But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes. <laughs> I'm on it. Go! Go in. Go in. Go. Go. Thank you. Look, it's Kate! Oh, I saved her! Look at her! Look at my baby! It's my baby! It's my baby! I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate. Listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, I'm doing even better. I'm so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying, you made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate, there are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping the balloons, though. One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. I love your illustrations. They got kind of dark there for a while, but I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was thinking of having some photographs in there too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? 
You better take the pictures, Max. <laughs> I'm going to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. I was surprised how many students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel and Mr. Jefferson, even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm glad you believe again, Kate. I'm working on it, Max. I just pray I can get this drawing right. Be Kate, it is so good to hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. Kate, I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan, like, a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh, yes. And you could bring Warren along, too. No boys allowed. No, no boys. boys. <laughs> Funny, no, right? boys! <laughs> I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. <laughs> well, I did get his ass suspended, so that might be a start. You did? Oh, right on, Max. I love how fearless you are. So what is going on with him now? I think his family is totally protecting him. Or, or worse. worse. I never say this about people, but Max, there's something evil about the Prescotts. They have something to do with death. We're going to stop him. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number, and I'll text it to you, okay? Of course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. I have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Tell Alice I'll see her soon. Okay, I have to leave now. Left mouse button. Well, how is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank God. I'm glad we came to see her. Thanks for coming Don't with me. me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. That little prick is not gonna be glad when he sees us. Jefferson! I suspect him of something now. From what, like, people have told me. I should suspect him of something, and I do, and I don't know how to feel. Who that kid? I've never seen- <gasps> It's Samuel! It's Samuel! Samuel is the Bay. Bay Sam. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, there. but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I no. have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Oh, oh. Poor teacher. Oh. Is this ch channel dictatorship? Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. 
Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring him. It's fine. <laughs> Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Sad. Makes me mad. How are you doing, Max? Oh. Been a tough week. I wanted to talk to Sam because he's yeah, my bae. Hi, Samuel. How are you? Sad and confused like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. Let's talk about More people. More questions than answers. Samuel is always here to talk. Nathan. Have you seen Nathan Prescott around? That would be hard since he was suspended. He deserved it. He deserved it. And more. Samuel tries not to judge people. <gasps> Nathan shouldn't be here. Samuel! Maybe he's Samuel! To be Samuel! What do you Samuel! Really know Samuel! Him? Samuel! Not to help Samuel! You, Max. Samuel! I truly wish I could. I see what you're doing. Ask about Kate. I actually just talked to Kate Marsh in the hospital. She's doing so much better. Because of you, Max. That was quite a rescue. Destiny? It could have gone either way. Samuel, do you think that we each have a destiny? Yes, I, I do, Max. In many different lifetimes, of course. Kate Marsh believed in something different, so... That's her destiny. I believe you. Kate just needed some more helpful spirits like her friend Max. I hope she finds them now. Oh, I love. Ever talk with David Matson? He talks to me. I listen. That's how David operates. He sees things, not people. But I, I think he sees you, Max. Why do you say that? Because, you both see with cameras. I think you have better vision than both of us. <laughs> no, Max. I just look at everything from a different angle. Thanks, sir. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. Squirrels! Let's oh, talk I'm about the squirrels! The squirrels are still healthy and happy on the campus. Because I love too. these squirrels. <laughs> if something happened to them. Oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. <laughs> Lots of food. Which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. Now, who can I ask? I think everything is changing here. As a Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. And I swear, it's not about that petition you didn't sign. Nathan, let's talk about Nathan. I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. Well, you knew him better. You probably know him better. I've tried. Nathan is a Prescott, and with that comes a lot of baggage. Too much for one teenager. This week was the proof. Principal Wells did the right thing. I know. Nathan needs real help. I yes, wish I had sub nice. emotes to give I to did people. Try <gasps> once, but Mr. Prescott didn't appreciate my help. I did see Nathan leaving the campus looking angrier than usual, so maybe it's good you haven't found him. Okay, I'll I'm leave. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Coast is clear. <gasps> then why you know me? <laughs> why you me? Oh my god, this is all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Really? Aww. Who's your first favorite streamer then? And who's this person? It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. 
Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. When there's trouble, you know who to call. Oh! It brings it. So room 111 is the magic number. Poor Warren. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. Aww. Let go. Howdy, wees. Yeah. Now I need to find Nathan's phone, or anything with clues. Wait. Appreciate you standing up for David. I know Chloe didn't stop acting out so much, especially when it happened if... Especially, except that it won't happen if you... Reading it's if... I know what happened, so don't bother defending it or explaining. Hope you get her back on the right track, and it looks like she's getting stuck again. David wants to help, but she won't let him. Such a good influence on her. Unless you both want to play bad. I'm sorry, Jace. I even get into Shane again, but I'm trying to get a good influence. Chloe! And that it was no emoji. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. Oh man, that dickhead stole one of my selfies. That looks like a totally fun show. <laughs> Even Nathan has a light side. Yeah, that's totally like me. Nathan Prescott, all American teen. Oh. Okay, so prescription pills, look. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. <laughs> Examine. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Right? Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Now I have that monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Bastard. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, that's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. 
It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. Yes, I would be cool with having this high-tech projector. That is so Chloe. Oh my god. Chloe. Nathan clearly has his fetish down. Uh, okay, let me just leave now. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. No, so Chloe what here. Did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Is that a credit Ooh, card? Man. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me, ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. You are so fucking dead! Uh, Get off me, bro! Uh, stop, Warren. I, I can't just... Warren, stop it! Come on! Oh, oh my head! Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you! You're all dead! Let's go, now! Plus? My dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. Yeah, there's a game delay. Like all the audio has Damn. delays right now. That was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? for headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Um, not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. <laughs> I know. He really did give a serious beatdown to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. <laughs> 